thanks for coming out and supporting me. Oh, I'm happy, guys. Uh, My name is Jerry. 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 Ladies and gentlemen, Gerald Yost. Oh, he's already recording? Yeah, he's like, he's really good. Look at it. He said I'm cute. <laughs> Gerald, what are you doing later? <laughs> For those of you that couldn't hear, somebody at his table just said wiping up wet spots. <laughs> Gerald, come here. By the way, being a former vegan, my wife being a formal vegan as well, yes, vegans can have oral sex as long as they do not swallow. <laughs> Alright, ladies and gentlemen, your next comedian is another comedy virgin. He is a very, 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 very funny gentleman. Um, there have been people trying to get him up on stage for months. <laughs> and uh, you heard Joel give him a shout out earlier tonight, so please welcome to the stage for the very first time, Mr. Cal Walks Over Ice. Yeah. Yeah. Over ice. I'm from Lodgegrass, Montana, otherwise known as Ishbia. So, okay, walks over ice. And everybody says, Cal, where does your last name come from? Walks over ice. Now that's so pretty. Can you tell me the story? I'm like, yeah, it's historical. You learned it in junior high. You know the land bridge theory. You know, Indians usually originally came from Asia. Walked over to frozen water near Alaska. Walks over ice. Before, when we were in Asia, it was walks over rice. Yeah, we switched it. Yeah, we switched it. So now, you know, we don't, we don't always use walks over ice all the time. Especially because that's too long to spell. I go by walks once in a while. I got some buddies, uh, stops at pretty places. Peas. So, a couple of buddies are hanging at the mall one time. Girl walks up to us. Hey, what's your guy's name? It's like, Sean Cal. It's Malville. It's Billy. Well, what's your last name? So I'm like, Walks, Stops, and Peas. <laughs> Wait! <laughs> hold on, hold on. I didn't mean that. Walks over, I stops at pretty places and peas. I'm sorry about that. There you go. My traditional name is Good Dancer. You know, good dancers. It was, shh, you know I can do it. <laughs> anyway, so that was a, oh, I can do the splits too, that's why I don't have to But, uh, so that name was given to my grandmother, you know. It's not the way you guys learn native names, like how to get you into name, like two dogs. Everybody knows that joke, right? So you're supposed to do something, if somebody asks you to name somebody, do something that was important in your life, what you accomplished in your life. So I asked my wife, they came and asked me, hey, they want, they want you to name this child, you know, one of your accomplishments. My wife said, oh, you ain't done shit. So that kid's walking around with that name now. It's embarrassing, but, you know, I gotta take my, my wife's, uh, you know, I gotta go with what my wife says. <laughs> You know, round of applause for my wife. She's, <laughs> She's doing good. She's doing good. Okay, Halloween. My parents used to dress me up as uh, one of those Walmart bums and take me to white neighborhoods <laughs> with a sign with a sign that says, "I bet you can't hit me with a quarter." <laughs> white neighborhoods walk on a, knocking on door. I never got candy for three years. <laughs> three years and I looked white. <laughs> Yeah, you know, that's a good one. <laughs> okay, you ever hung out with natives, like, go on a basketball tournament, a softball trip, or whatever? Whatever. Go out of town. You're in the countryside. Natives, they're driving around. You see a nice paint horse driving around in the pasture. Man, that's a pretty horse. Wow, 
I wish I had it in my pasture. All the non-natives start laughing. <laughs> and the Indians, you all, I mean, every time they see your pretty horse, they say, oh, what a nice horse. It looks like a mountain to me. I was like, bullshit. You white guys, you see a lion, you start jacking off. You Asians see a pig, you're like, oh, I want to hide Same thing. It's the same emotion. I want that in my pasture. <laughs> Okay, I'm a junior, okay? I'm a junior. My dad has the same name as me, blah, 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 blah. Okay, you know how many natives are named Junior? Go to the mall on per capita day. Stand in the middle. Stand in the middle. Yeah, Junior! Shit, don't be about eight guys and about four girls turn around and go like that. Try it once, I dare you. All right. You know, we're all from Montana. Montana, by birth, crow by the great grace of God, you know? So these crows, they named their kids Corral, Stare Up, and Rope. I'm like, what? Why would you name your kid? I mean, I understand the rest in culture. We're country folk, blah, blah, blah. But still, it should be like Arrow, or TP, <laughs> or Nike. <laughs> Did you guys know that Mike Tyson and Kobe Bryant are native too? <laughs> They're a rape hoes. <laughs> okay, on the rest, there's not a lot of South Towers. Not a lot of South Towers. So if you see a group of cars together all at one point, in place. They are not trying to have a power. They are trying to send a text. <laughs> and they're texting the person that's right next to them. You can get out the car and knock on their window and say, hey, do you show that chick the loan? And, but no, you gotta send a text. Because that's what we do nowadays. Okay. You guys watch that Goodwill Hunting? How do you like them apples? Remember that? It's a whole different thing to us natives. How do you like them apples? You know, red on the outside, white on the inside. They get beat up. <laughs> hey, why do Asians don't like to come to the res? Because they think we're racist to them. We got chain nets on our basketball goose. We make it, instead of going swish, we go chink. <laughs> they get pissed off. My name is Cal Walks and Rice. My first time. Have a good evening. Yeah. Ladies and gentlemen, Mr. Cal Walks Over Ice. Give it up. We've sacrificed two versions tonight. We've got two, man, two more comics left. Unless any other versions want to be sacrificed. Sadie. 